Like many works by Rene Magritte, The False Mirror defies normal insights of the viewer. It was completed in 1928. It is one of many pieces that were created in between World War I and World War II as artists attempted to come to terms with the horrible conditions that these conflicts caused. This oil on canvas painting is housed in the Museum of Modern Art in New York. The False Mirror is a magical surrealistic painting. The False Mirror is a painting of a large, unblinking eye, with no eyelashes present. A large black pupil is located in the center. The iris is painted to represent a bright blue sky with floating, white, fluffy clouds. The False Mirror is widely acknowledged to represent the limitations of human vision. A mirror reflects what is places before it. Whereas the eye is subjective, it filters and processes those images that it wishes to see. Rene Magritte was born in Belgium in 1898 and died of pancreatic cancer in 1967. He had what some would call a sad life. His mother died when he was very young. His career as an artist was interrupted by World War II and he never really achieved fame or a lot of praise while he was still alive. Yet he was able to channel the challenges he dealt with into impactful and unforgettable art. Magritte was a Belgian surrealist artist. Magritte is best known for his unusual but extremely realistic paintings that challenge our perception of reality. He felt the greatest purpose of art was surprise. He challenged what we are used to seeing by exaggerating size, space, and positioning of objects. He painted objects and people in a realistic style that always changed something or put them in a strange order to produce the unexpected. He referred to this art technique as poetic imagery because he was playing with familiar images and creating a new, unfamiliar poetic picture.